What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Show down is the Blazer King, and we're back with Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. There ain't too much left to do in the story, so without further ado. Oh, though there was that one fucking annoying ass mission where I had to beat up on a bunch of Frieza's forces and then Frieza himself, all while trying to protect Jocko. Anyone else done that mission? How many attempts did it take you? And, uh, go ahead and comment that, because I'm curious. It took me like three or four just now. All because Jocko is the most worthless sack of shit in this game. Even more so than Hercule. And Hercule's my mentor. Hell, Hercule even had to come to that fight and aid me. And Jocko lived on one hit point by the time I finished it. What dog? Then I switched back to this move to do it since Super Dragon Fist wasn't really working. <sighs> Dang, none of these moves really work when someone, you know, busts them out of it. That's why I always like my good old fashioned rocks. Even though that time it was completely useless. Um, I love how Beerus was fighting with us, and then he's just like, nope, I'm gonna go wash off this face paint that was put on my face by Wiss. At least this time my move can't be interrupted because Beerus knocks him out of it. Ha ha! I kicked you in the back and now you die! Ow! Da -da 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 -da. Bah! Oh, come on! That was just so fucking rude. That sounds fine. Yeah, so tall, so upstanding, uh, Trunks. And there goes Toki Toki just kind of flying around. Ah. Ah. Maybe I should have saved recording this one for tomorrow night. Oh well. Yeah, yeah, they do.
You know, I honestly thought episode-wise, the series would take a lot longer. But I guess I am skipping a lot of the whole off or a lot of the extra stuff than story mode. You know, all the instructors and missions and whatnot, but that's because, like I showed in that one episode, the Krill and Yamcha missions are bullshit. And the instructor, instructor missions are experience fodder, and that's about it. Uh, who got added as an instructor? What? I'm... Oh, wait, probably. Never mind, it's a useless sack of shit. I'll go to the boo house and then... Just continue with the story mode stuff, because honestly, I really could care less about Jocko. I will get his stuff for experience fodder, but that... That can wait until after this episode, because I really do not give a fuck about speaking to him after the shit that mission put me through. Because that mission... Ugh. Oh, yeah, and if anybody wants any, uh, those things, for some ungodly reason. Just gonna go around picking up some additional food before I go to Majin House. Okay, well there's fish. See, I hope I can see this view on my boo account just yellow <laughs> I have to make sure to take my finger off the button as soon as I'm ready to feed them just to make sure I don't fuck up they're all yellow and I want to keep it that way the Namekians. I'm just gonna... or well, not fuck the Namekians. Fuck Jocko. And if there's nothing else important for us to do... Oi! 
there's another instructor other than Jocko? As much as I would like to go continue the story, I actually kind of want to find out who this other instructor is. Because either I forgot about somebody, or they weren't worth remembering. Oh. Yeah, they weren't worth remembering. I just look down see Pan, and it's like, oh. Yeah, I don't care. Like, obviously I will do them off screen, but... I already did them on the first account I did, so I already have the moves, so the only reason to do it would be the experience. And experience I can gain off screen. So. Actually, how many of these eggs do I have? Oh, I have all of them. Well, let's just mosey our way down to her. of them. Yeah, so basically I got in hand here are those five eggs for story progress. Woo! However, let's continue in this story. Hell, if I can finish the game before I go to bed, that'd be cool. Unlikely, knowing my luck, there'll still be a whole fucking other episode's worth of shit to do. Even after whatever I do remaining here. I normally like things quiet, but it's making me nervous. Maybe you should take action. What sort of action? What? Oh, you have to... <sighs> okay, I'm back. My fucking dog's retarded because she looks at me and whines and wags her tail like she needs to go potty and then it's like, Oh, hey, I'm a stupid fucking mutt. I don't need to do anything. I'm just going to stand out here and watch you m make your bowl shrink in the cold. Because, you know, it's fucking snowing out and it's like 30 degrees. Probably less. Fucking <sighs> hate my animals. Now the dumb cow is going to have to not be in my room because I don't trust her. Jerry shit in my room once before. <sighs> yeah, how do we about Pliny and Bardock? Blah, blah, and blah, and blah, and blah. Let's go find Bardock and blah, and blah, and... I don't fucking care about this story mode, man. This story really is just... Go back and fix the fuck-ups up fuck ups in time. Trunks is retarded. Mira... Er, Mira. Toa and Mira are a couple of cunts. 99% of the missions that don't have to do with the story mode are filled with cunts.
age? Question mark, question mark, question mark. Yeah, doesn't that remind you of your earth? Hey, that ass. And them titties. Toa got some nice titties, though. Okay, so Trunks, if you're just gonna fight Bardock, I'm gonna go after Mira, so we're not getting in each other's way, like you normally are for me. Just in my way. No, 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 I hit him, I hit him. I love how it totally pretended like I didn't hit him with it. Okay. Why did it just start going for the move that I wasn't using? No! I didn't want to fucking hit that move! I will tell you when I want to use Death Meteor, okay? Well, since Trunks is a useless piece of shit... See, Trunks, that's all you had to do. You could have thrown rocks at him, and it would have beat him. Well, since I got cut out five minutes worth of what time I normally would have gone with because of my freaking wasting time with that dog. Suppose we can get one more fight in. Hey, guess what? I'm a good guy after all. Yeah, it doesn't work, buddy.
Yeah, I dare you make a fool of me. Next time it's not about the Saiyans. Or even my son, Goku. Wait, that's not right. Anyway, I'm here for payback. I'ma take you into this void between dimensions, cause fuck you! Mirror's a girl's name anyway! Oh, hey, thanks, Bardock. <sighs> yeah, that's right, you're on your knees like you should be. Oh shit! She had an ace in the hole. She had a pram too. Irma Gun. Okay. I love how I just start punching in the wrong direction. Wow, a D? Was I supposed to beat up Toa first? I mean, I guess I was supposed to beat up Toa first, but how was I supposed to know that? It didn't say, beat up Toa first! It just said, defeat all enemies. And now Trunks had no idea who the fuck she was. Yeah, I guess what all we ended up with was that mask. Uh, where'd you end up anyway? I went through a wormhole, you know, saw some friends. I said hi to Janamba after we kicked his ass again. Oh, and then we saw Bardock and Toa and Mira and Bardock turned on them and well. What did your partner do? Wait, you're my partner, right? Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure. The whole place is becoming evil.
Hugh and Trunks go check out the shit that's going down. While we give you a break. Well, in that case, I suppose it is time to end off the episode. <laughs> so, as usual, if you enjoyed what you saw, don't forget to, uh, I don't know, justice combination, the like button. To keep updated, like Facebook, follow Twitter, and of course subscribe. And perhaps in the next episode we will find out where did Bardock and Mira go? What happened to the hero of Content City? And what the hell is up with Mira being a per or Toa being a perfectionist? Find out all of these things next time on Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2.